Why am I smoking with this old ass dude? What are you doing here? Why are you here? Just, you know, I don't want to smoke coma, pot man. with you. God. Yeah, what does this look like? A crackhead foundation? What the fuck do you want from me? Shit. Fine, I'll fucking smoke outside. Huh? Yeah, smoke God outside. I will. I don't give a fuck. I'll smoke in my car. I bet you won't. Can I join you? No. That's pretty fucked up. Why you gotta be so mean to the old man? Because um, I don't want to smoke you. I don't even know why you're here. I don't even know where Fine. you showed up from. Good. Leave. Fuck Bye. you. Bye. Fuck it. Young Bye. Bitch ass. Fucking bitch. Bye. <laughs> fucking old people. Wanting to smoke pot with young people. Hey. What are you hey, doing? Man. No. Hey. What Hold the on. People in this city are fucking <laughs> rude. <laughs> Fine. Fuck off. Whatever. I'll get my own weed. Smoke my own weed. Corner of the street. Uh, I can help you, sir. Hey, man, there's some guy in there. I just drove past the thing and I stopped to have a cigarette outside. And I smelled a whole bunch of pot coming from the bottom level of the uh, motel over there. All right, do you know the exact location? I, I don't know the exact location, but I, when I was leaving, some guy was like, Hey, man, hey, hey, and he was in like some red shirt with like a big, like brown or black beard. I don't know what he was doing, but it smelled like so much pot. Uh, it was insane. So I just thought I'd let you guys know. I saw you here when I pulled in to smoke a cigarette because I don't like to smoke in my car. So wanted to let you guys know. All right, I'll go take a look. Thank you for that, sir. Okay. Bravo 39 to 1 Tom 24. 24. I have that. Ten ones. Uh, oh, never mind. Describe male. He's currently headed e e eastbound Algonquin Boulevard. Ten four. Uh, I believe I have eyes on. Would you like me to initiate? Brother thirty one. Do you brother or Christian Tom twenty four direct? Twenty four standby. Hello, sir. What's up? Wow. Go ahead and put that down for me. Nah, I'm good. Sir, go ahead and put that down for me. Or what? I uh, need you to put it down. That is really strong. It's legal, it bro. Down. It's not legal to be at smoking that out in public, sir. It's legal. In your own home, maybe, but not out here in public. I. This is my home. Sir, this is a, a storefront. I'm homeless. Go ahead and put that. Well, then you shouldn't be smoking that outside at all, then. Um, the, the, the outside is my home. <coughs> Everywhere's my home. Sir. All on this street. Put it down, sir. This is fucked. Go ahead and turn around for me. Why? Turn around, put your hands in, uh, on your head. Why? I'm putting you. That was. I'm putting you uh, in cuffs right now for my safety and for yours. Go ahead what? And turn around. I'm safe. I'm all safe. Well, I don't feel very safe. You don't feel very safe? No, Little sir. marijuana makes you feel unsafe? Yes, it does. You grew up in 1920? Is it 1937 right now? There you go, sir. Because I thought it was 2017. Oh, it's 2017, but it's still illegal for you to be smoking that outside, sir. Oh, come on. You know better. Don't yeah, but just, you, you know, come on. Nope. Uh, uh, 24 to 31. 31, go ahead. Can you start my way? 10 4, show me in route code 1. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm going to go and search real quick. Do you have anything I need that's going to stick and poke me, otherwise, harm me? Nah, probably just more weed. More weed? All right. 35, give us one to dispatch. Hey man, you're the guy I bought the drugs off of last week. Hey, hey, hey. what can the? I, can I get I don't more know drugs? You, dude. I don't fucking what? know you. Sir, go ahead and put your hands on your back for me. Hey man, back. What I do you mean? I don't fucking know you. Get this guy away from me. Your back. Who are you? Back. 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 Thirty. Who are you? I'm putting in the cuffs. Don't get between. Back. Okay, I. Thirty. Back up. Uh, Bravo thirty-one control. I just want a drug from him. I don't know what the Perfect. fuck that guy's talking about. Show me you 23 with no 10, 12, him, per so 24. Get out of here. Right, sir. sir, he's 30. He's being placed under arrest. Yep. Never mind. He's, You're under arrest right now. trying to buy drugs. Is this not illegal to buy drugs? It's very illegal to buy drugs, sir. Only if you buy a drugs. You're attempting to solicit drugs. I cannot have a sex with drugs. I, 
Okay. I mean, whatever you do on your own time is <laughs> what you do, sir. 31, go ahead and handle this one. I'm yep, going to go over here. That dude's fucking... Yeah, you deal what with that. the fuck is that right, guy? Sir, uh, go ahead and follow me, please. Oh. oh. What? Yes, uh, follow me, please. You have uh, the drugs. I do have uh, the drugs. <laughs> okay. Hey. You want to go ahead and uh, handle this guy since you're SCU? Sure. All right, I'll just back you up. Sir, have you ever seen that Asian man? <laughs> I have never seen that. No. no. Ever? <laughs> Ever. I that you I have no uh, idea. Do you have any any other weapons you guys drugs anything on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, or hurt me? Oh no. What's your first name? Henry. Henry Henry, uh what's your last name? Henry. Henry Henry? Henry Henry. Henry Henry. Uh, Henry Henry, have you had any type of illegal substance or any type of uh narcotics? No. Maybe any alcohol today? Nope. Everything is just getting sure. Yep. 100%? Yes. And if we search you, we're not going to find anything? So why do you... i trying to buy a drugs! So you haven't... Oh, you wanted to buy drugs. Okay, I get it. So you have no drugs, you wanted to buy drugs. Totally. Okay, perfect. Well, that's uh, that's simple. You just want to buy drugs, right? Yes. And uh, what kind of drugs? Weed. Just weed? Yes, oh, a weed. Yes. Just a weed? Okay. All right. Well, uh... Cool. Right, sir, what's your name? Uh, John. John what? Harvick. John Harvick? Yep. Alright. Um, uh, 39, just for reference, I did find uh, four more baggies of weed on this gentleman here. Would you say that he has more than about 28 grams? I couldn't tell you. I got 22. You got 22? 20, 22, 22 grams. grams. Okay. Well, he helped you out there. And okay. your name's John Harvick? This yeah. Alright. Well, sir, do you, know, do you know this guy in the red? Is he like a, a friend, a dealer? He's a gut of my drugs. Oh, so you were picking up drugs from him? For the fourth of time, yes! I was a picking oh, well, up the drugs! Well, first of all, you said you wanted to buy some. I didn't know if this was, this was like a scheduled pickup. Did you Pick like up, a, dr a buy? Same a thing? I'll be right back. Well, I mean, buys like it's a diff you know just a different type of context. So you 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 made arrangements to pick them up from him today. No, no. So you just you were walking. You're like, hey man, do you sell drugs? And he's like, yeah. And then you're. I wanted to buy us some drugs. Okay, but how did you know that he specifically, the guy that you went up and talked to, had drugs? Because he purchase? smelled like a drugs. That's a good statement. I you know what that I I feel you on that one. That's perfect. It's uh, so just pungent. Just hang tight one moment, all right? Oh, okay. Okay, 24, sir. 31. 31, go ahead. Uh, I'll be advised I ran his name for you. Uh, you guys come back clear six citations previously. Yeah, it looks like he just wanted to buy some weed. Uh, he might be under the influence of some, but I mean, he's standing up, not wobbling, not falling or anything, so I'm sure he's capable to walk. Did he come in a vehicle or did he walk up? Uh, I didn't see he came around the corner. I assume he came I in a vehicle. We rolled up, I observed him coming around the corner on foot, so. Okay, just let's keep him here for a little bit, and then once we figure out what's up with Mr. Redshirt over there, we'll deal with, uh, I want to buy a drugs guy. And 39 be advised, this guy came back, uh, clear three citations for you. Okay. Alright, Henry, I'm gonna place you in this vehicle for right now, and then, uh, we're gonna get back with you in just a second, okay? Alright. Okay, John, so, considering you have 22 ounces of marijuana, that is a felony in the state of San Andreas. What? I thought it was 30. Uh, no, sir, it's 14. Oh, shit. I mean, Good I've question. got 13 ounces. Oh, oh, there's a scale on the back of my truck if you want to weigh it. Oh, he's a got the drugs. It's oh, just, oh, I'm not hurting anybody out here. I mean, just... Hey, sir, quiet down. Sir, this is obviously being used for recreational use, not medical. So well, No, I, that, my, I got bad knees. You, do you have a, a prescription on you at all? Uh, yeah, am I, am I, uh, in that pocket on my pants, the, the cargo one on the side? Okay, let me just check that really quick. It came back as 22.21. Okay, thank you. 24. Yeah. Are those individual baggies? Uh, three individuals. Uh, well, I mean, no, that's, you know, that's how they sell them. When you, that's when I go to the, them. when I go so to the marrow... Yeah, when I well when I go to the club, they only offer you know a certain size, so you got to buy multiple of that size. And they are in your possession because you're legal to have it. Okay. And the state of San Andreas, if 
they are separate baggies of a narcotic. It is indicative of intent to sell. Ah, uh, I'm not selling anything, man. Okay, but I'm buying. You, I understand that, but you have if you have if your medical card comes back clear, um, we still have an issue, which is the individual baggies, which is indicative of intent to sell. So we'll talk about that in a second, but let him check out your medical card real quick. Uh, it should be valid. I just got it last month. I'm not trying to hurt anybody. I'm just, you know, I can just okay. I trying to smoke a little while I run my errands, that's all. I understand that, but right, considering five we want to one. Considering we walked up on you smoking marijuana, uh, that is under the influence of controlled substance right now. And that is a misdemeanor. You can write me a ticket for misdemeanor, right? It's a punish punishable by imprisonment. Uh, but hey, you, can, you can help me out a little bit. Cut me a break. Sir, I cannot do that for you. Oh, right fucking. This sucks. Can no I go home? Hang on, man. If this dude's good, um, we don't really have anything on him criminally. Other than him wanting to buy drugs, which is not a crime, so... And we'll just cut him loose. Yeah, that's true. I figured take him around the block and just let him go a little bit further away from the scene. That way oh. he doesn't come back as quick. All right. Nothing crazy. I'm not feeling it today. All right, sir. So here's what's going to happen. Um, you're not under arrest at this point. Uh, we're just going to take you away from the scene here, and we're going to go ahead and cut you free, all right? All right. And uh, no buying drugs today. Are we clear? Buy a lot of drugs today. No, buy zero. Take today. me home. Yep. Not no taxi. Then don't take me around the corner. Well, I am taking you around the corner. Then you are a taxi. Whatever I look like in your eyes. Let's go, taxi. Uh, so I can, it's, you know, I, so I won't have a felony. I'm just being arrested uh, for a misdemeanor. It is going to be two misdemeanors, actually. Uh, possession of a controlled <laughs> substance along with uh, clip, clip. under the influence of a controlled substance. Okay, but no felonies. Nope, but you will be. Okay, today. I, I, I mean, I, I'm not happy with that, but I, I guess I'm okay with. I mean, no felonies. That's. I'm not trying to get a felony. That's all. Okay, I understand that, but next time, make sure you keep it at home, and just keep that as limited as you can. Oh, I mean, absolutely. I guess when I'm at home, that's not gonna happen. But yeah. Okay. Uh. I'll, does someone want to transport him to uh who's got the vic who's got the I weed do. hey what are you sir really what i'm yeah. just wondering i'm just it was just you, a point. well you did i'll yeah. ride with that guy whoever's um, got it <laughs> so do when i got the the weed and the everest bag okay so car. i'll ride with it, you yeah let's let no i'm not gonna ride with him because he doesn't have a partition uh uh, Does somebody SC say Lincoln? I got to the weed? Is this guy really back? Not this guy again. Get, get this guy away from me. John, get this John, guy away. Let's go ahead and get you in a car, Do Did we right. not just have a talk with you, sir? I just want Jesus. to know who got to Henry. the weed. Henry. That guy is crazy. All right. It's no, a... Henry, you're not leaving this I time. can leave. Come here, Henry. No. Henry? Henry, stop. Henry. What? I took you far away, and I let you go, right? It's a free country. Yes, I understand. I cannot go anywhere. Sir... You obviously can I not to go to anywhere? Yes, technically you it's are. It's a North Korea. If you want to go back to North Korea, you can go back to North Korea. <sighs> Have fun. There's something what? with that guy. Uh, you guys need to him. arrest he's him. He's not in a car, but he is a danger to himself. <laughs> <laughs> I. Uh... Oh man, Sandy Shores. Next time, he's pretty nice to dispatch. Sandy fucking shores. <laughs> Sandy fucking yeah, that shores. Dude comes back, I'm arresting him for disorderly conduct. <laughs> Bravo 39. Uh, 39. Show me 1015. Oh, nice car. Yeah. Very nice. Oh. Are you Henry? You are got to the drugs. What's that? Where are the let's drugs? Go, I don't. You know, let's go in the motel. Why are you? Why you want to go in the motel? Because there's fucking cops around here, man. Why? What? Why you get in your car? I got, it's a nicer car. Okay, well, park it up and meet me somewhere inside the. Okay, well, that, I mean, that's not really much different from it being there, but okay, it's, follow it's me. It's a on the street. 
Gotta find an open room here. Let's see if we can... Oh. Hmm. <laughs> oh, they are, they are everywhere. Hmm. <laughs> this might not be a good area. Uh, maybe over here. We're just gonna have to go over here. There we go. Here's an open room. Give me the drugs. All right, here you go. Oh, Love you. that's a good amount of drugs. Where are you going? What do you mean? Stay here. Why? Stay here and smoke with me. I will smoke a one thing I wet to you. Smoke all your shit with me. No. I, I think you're a cop. Uh, you, you, go cop? you go fuck a yourself. Okay, well, you know, that's not nice. Well... You go fuck it yourself. I smoke oh, one thing. I like how I suck on it really quick before I actually start <laughs> smoking on it. Make sure it's nice and damp and good before we. Uh, oh, I'm just breathing it in. Smelling this is it. so <coughs> so goddamn good. Yeah, none of that North Korea shit. It's the best thing. Oh, Kim Jong Ooh, that's a, my guy right there. What? You got the problem with me? You say Kim Jong-un is your guy? Yeah. Oh, fuck this. Get the fuck out of here. Fuck what you. do you mean? Go back in your car and get the fuck out wow, of here. Wow, you North know what to Korean smoke a drug with me. Not fuck, with a North Korean. Fuck a you. Fuck it. Fuck a you. Fuck smoke huh? Oh, fuck a police. Hey, dude. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. <laughs> Fuck you big time. Yeah. You think I'm mad at me? Too. Fuck you. <laughs> god damn. Oh shit. <laughs> I think you're getting blurfed. Fuck you. Crazy ass motherfucker. Going around here, acting nuts. Fuck you, the weed is so good. Ah, uh, it's nice not being disturbed. Smoke outside. Nobody says shit. Ah, uh, it's a fuck of you. Ow. Oh sh. Oh shit. Uh, it's a nope. Ah. Nope. Nope. Mm mm. Nope. Sir, stop uh, where you are right now. Hey! Fuck. It's oh, that God. guy who sell me the weed who making me go crazy! <laughs> don't get the fuck away from me, man. I don't know. Who taser, the taser. fuck are you? Stop following me. Two tasers deployed. Oh, it's a... He seems to not be... It's a... It's a... The Maybe. drugs! They're downstairs. Wait. Wait, there... Is it that guy stop that moving. has the drugs? Stop moving. Taser, taser, taser. Somebody get that guy who's in the red. Where did he yeah. go? Yeah. He's, uh, he's running uh, eastbound towards the police station. Get that guy who's in the red. Uh, just stop. And get your hands up. Huh? Sir, stop running. My hands are up. And I just wave them like I just uh, don't care. Get him, get him in cuffs. Let's get a car. Right, you're being placed under arrest right now. Felony eluding. Oh, He's, uh, stop. the other individual still 1070, uh, by the police station, lost eyes. The guy in the red uh, sold me bad drug. Okay, we deal with him later. You come with me now. Okay. Why are you mimic me? Sir, put your what? hands up. Put your what? hands up. What? What'd I do? Put your hands up, sir. What are you talking about? What's going on? From police, put your hands up. I didn't run. What? 3124 direct. 24. To location for car. Uh, we Somebody want to cover me while I go in for cops? Face away from me, sir. In the middle of the... Uh, Hotel, we're coming out now to the parking lot. 10 4. Why the heck are you running from me? I wasn't running from cops. I was running, but not from cops. Officer, Officer you cuffed yourself. Uh, hey, Asian, that. sir, why are you running? What? I uh, run up because he gave me a bad of drugs. 67, this is Henry. We just had contact with him earlier for trying to buy drugs from somebody, which so I believe is like the same person that took off running. Alright, Henry. 
not sure what you're on, but uh, apparently it made you run from me at 90 miles an hour. He assaulted me about the drugs. Okay. Did you guys search him? I'm getting ready to do that. I just got him in my car right now. I'm trying to put my yeah. gun away and stuff. From what I heard, I think he said he sold him a bag of drugs, so but, I mean, there should be a bag of drugs on him. No, he said bad drugs. Uh, well, he should still have drugs, right? Well, it might not be a bag, but... I mean, so we'll I'm see, pretty sure we'll he see. smoked we'll them all. <laughs> they must be that bad, then. Bravo 143 to dispatch. We have that <laughs> other individual uh, in custody right now. He's uh, at a Zancudo... Or, yeah, Zancudo and Alhambra Drive, just next to the police station. Henry? What do you want? How much bad drugs did you buy? He brought me into the hotel in a smoke of the bad drug. Oh, so you didn't buy any? You said you don't have anything on you? You smoked it with him? Yes. Okay. Sounds Was good it like a, like a sample, or were you intending on buying afterwards? He'll want to smoke at a drug. Okay. Do you know him? You friends with him? Sir in the red shirt, if you want to go yeah, ahead and, drug uh, dealer. back to the cruiser over here. Oh, he's and a sit drug the back dealer. Well, what's his let... name? I don't know. Don't know. Okay. I'm, uh... So, so can you radio the other units to see if they can get their investigation and see what the heck happened here? Yep, yeah, let me radio 24, I think he's over there. Uh, 31, 24 direct. 24. 73 on the situation over there. Uh, standby, I just arrived. Uh, 29 phase 2 primary. Uh, 29, or correction, 26, do you copy? 10 for copy. Uh, do you have a 73 a situation? Uh, currently, um, well, not 10 15, but we have him in custody in the back of my vehicle. We were about to uh, start questioning after you got all the story from your gentleman. Yeah, 10 4. Our, our guy, uh, Henry over here, is stating that he's a drug dealer and they went up into one of the hotel rooms and they uh, were smoking the drugs. I don't know, like a sample session or something. Um, something like that. All right, uh, sir, can you tell me uh, what exactly happened that led to that whole situation back there? Uh, I I don't know. I guess you guys were involved in some sort of pursuit or some shit, and it rolled up into the hotel, and I was hanging out over there, and I was like, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I ran, so you got out of the area. you and the that uh, we were pursuing not interact at any point? Nope. All right, because the gentleman over there is saying that the both of you were actually in one of the uh, rooms of that broken down motel trying out the drugs that you apparently sold him. That was the same guy from last time that tried to say that I was a drug dealer. You're going to believe what he says? Well, if he's repeating the same story, you were in the area. Why were you in the area? Uh, I was just chilling. I was just hanging out. You're just hanging out at a just uh, hanging out. hotel. Yeah, man. You know, it's quiet over Dude, there. There's not much traffic. Make a familiar face. Okay. Uh, one what are you going to do? Bravo 26 to uh, one Bravo I'm gonna go 31. Talk to him. One Bravo 26, one Bravo 31. 31, go ahead. Uh, this is the same gentleman that apparently you stopped earlier, red shirt. Uh, this, the Henry over there uh, claimed that he was a drug dealer. He's, again, denying the whole situation. He doesn't even, uh, he doesn't even agree that they were in the same place. All right, um, we're going to go ahead and pack it up and move over there because uh, I do want to ask that guy who's supposedly the dealer a question. Uh, and we'll, we'll be over there in about three minutes. 10-4. Can you advise 20? Uh, 20 is crossing Kuda Avenue, Alhambra, right across the street from the police station in a parking lot. 10 4, we're en route. Just right, 10 so, um, is car still over here. Our supervisor for street crimes is going to be over here in just a minute, and he's going to be able to talk to you more, but there are definitely some conflicting stories going on here. Now, if, if you and this gentleman have a past with one another, even if it's maybe 30 minutes apart, we need to sort that out. And uh, hopefully, if you know there's there's nothing to hold you for, we can let you go again. But uh, hanging out in that um, motel doesn't seem to be the brightest idea from now on. Uh, I mean, yeah, I shouldn't have been in there, but it was just quiet. I was just chilling, hanging out in there, and then I saw this guy come in, followed by a bunch of cops, and he jumped out of his car while I was moving. I was like, I'm gone. I don't need to be around this situation. Whatever's oh, happening, and I took off running. I didn't hey, even know what cop was chasing friend, me. The drug dealer. Uh, you give it. Is that in that car? Oh, God. 67. Oh. Just put him back in the What's that you're yeah. doing? Jesus, Jesus Christ. Hey, Turn around what? And get back in that car, oh, sir. Oh, okay. Jesus, Jesus. Sir, sir, step away. Okay. He kicked out my window. I need another unit's car. Throw him in. What is wrong with you, Henry? He's a good a drug dealer. That's wonderful. Why don't you go ahead and just walk him over to the station? Remember me, right man? Over there, just get him in a cell. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Cause... Henry. I'll walk with you because this is just ridiculous. So I guess you bought it out pretty fast, huh? What's the drug yeah, dealer's name? Yeah, I mean, you know, it was those misdemeanors you can get out pretty easy. 
Anyone know and the we dealer's not... name? What? What? The dealer's name. What's Just the dealer's name? I was talking to a chat with him. I didn't, okay, whatever. Well, yeah, yes, we sir. talked earlier. I'm John Harvick. I didn't talk to you earlier. I was oh. dealing with your friend, Henry. I was talking with somebody earlier. Okay. Well, you prob we all look the same, so. You know. <laughs> That's true. But uh, I'm black, actually, but I was I was talking to him for a second. Are you, are you stereotyping? <laughs> nope. Just stated in the obvious. Yeah, I remember that guy. <laughs> That's who I was talking to. And yeah, you kind of okay, just, yep, okay. you know, well, shoved yourself into this conversation. Yeah, well. <laughs> That's no, a fun you, a conversation over no. there. <laughs> the part, somebody, the one with glasses, I, mean. I remember the black guy from earlier, and then this yep. other guy came in here and shoved his way, and I was talking to the other guy like, oh, we talked earlier. You remember my name? And then this guy was like, I no, I don't. Henry. Oh, okay, well, I got okay. called over here. Um, I'm the street crime supervisor for the Los Santos Police Department. Uh, I run the whole gang division and you know drug division, all that kind of crap. Oh, okay. Um, so from what I'm understanding, you're this Henry guy's dealer now. Uh, what? You know. <laughs> no. He, he told us. <laughs> no. That Okay, well, let me talk, and then you can talk. How about okay, that? Okay, just don't call me that motherfucker's dealer. I don't know that dude. Well, he told me that you knew him, and that you guys went up to one of the rooms, and you guys were smoking it up, and, you know, having some sort of session, whether it's like a sample session. I don't know what you want to call it, really. I hope that's all that was happening in that room, but, you know, I, I wasn't there, so I, I mean, can't not really... Teach his own. Of course he told you that. He's crazy. That okay, was the so, same dude that when last time I got arrested and you know, I was talking to the cops, he walks up to me asking for drugs with a bunch of cops around. Well, He's crazy. Thing, though, but the last time when you got arrested, you had several bags of marijuana on you. Okay. Yes. But yes. does that just exclude me from any no, you're future gonna truth telling? You are going to have your side of the story. So I want you to tell me what happened. I mean, what I, were you guys doing in the room? And I wasn't. I don't know. I wasn't near that dude. I wasn't in a room with that dude. I was hanging out. The, you were I was hanging out at the motel. Uh -huh. And so you were there. Yeah. I mean, obviously, I was there. I was hanging out at the motel, and then I saw that's a little bit messed up. And then I saw a huge pursuit just enter the motel, and I was like, "Don't need to be around this." So I took mm -hmm. off running to get out of that area. I didn't even know a cop was chasing me. I looked behind me. I didn't see anybody, so I just kept going. And then I stopped here, and cops came up and told me to put my hands up, so I don't know. Okay, well, it's obvious that he's under arrest for felony evasion. Uh, he ran from us, so that's He should obvious. be on... He sh you, you should keep he him might, locked yeah, they're, up. He's, they're gonna they're gonna do some testing on him. He's probably... Yeah, there's something, something not right with him. Um, he's got seven years. That seems to be the, the standard. <laughs> Did you guys find anything on uh, Mr. Harvick over here? I've got nothing on me. I've got nothing in my pockets. 26, do you copy? Go for 26. Uh, this guy, I mean, does he have anything? Are you gonna let him go, or are you gonna... Uh, I'm him? gonna relay to, uh, 1Bravo 143, because he's the one that searched him. Did you see any, did you find anything on him when you cuffed him? Uh, negative. He was all clean. Alright, uh, if, if we don't have the evidence I mean, that's, uh, compelling enough to bring him in, I say that we either, uh, bring him down to the station just to write his own report with, uh, detectives, or we can just let him go. Well, he was in the abandoned motel, and, I mean, if, was he in a room? Do we know that? Uh, when I was running after Henry over there, he was running through a room, but I didn't actually well, see him I would, in one. I would consider that trespassing, right? I guess you could if you wanted I mean, to. I mean, we could just write him a little citation. Guys, he opened that's up man. earlier that he was in a hotel room, so... Okay, I mean, that's cool. We can hit him up with a citation for trespassing. That's uh, that's fucked up, man. You guys out trying to get everybody. Yeah, well, that's that a really simple doing. little ticket. Um, you know, you kind of self-incriminated yourself when you said you were chilling in the hotel room, but just saying. I thought I said I was chilling at the hotel. Well, you said you were in a hotel. Uh, I don't remember that. All right, sir. Well, I'm going to go ahead and write up the citation for you for this trespassing. Yeah, yeah. So just write up all the citations. Good. Sign is on the dotted line, please. I, yeah, oh, you can't sign. You're actually in cuffs right now, yeah. so hang tight. Can someone get him out of the car and uh, get him ready to sign this ticket, and then we'll have him on his merry way? Yeah, the yep, good I'll thing is you're not going back to jail. I mean, yeah, that's good, but you guys are writing me some bullshit ticket. Look, you got bigger the, fish to look. fry over here writing me a fucking trespassing ticket. Okay, well, look, if, look, it's either going to jail with Henry or getting a ticket. What are you going to arrest me for? Sign on the line, please. Yeah. Cabron? <laughs> I'll sign on the line. I'll sign Cabron? on the line. Cabron? Gotcha. Oh, no. Oh. Cabron, is that you? Stop. You got the, the hey, drug? Hey, Jesus. Oh, you got an oh my right. God. Oh, Stop. What's up, man? Yo, get homeboy. over there Stop. across the street, man. Uh, hey, that's my drug on, dealer, mate. <laughs> get over oh, there across the street. I'm shaving the beard, dude. Oh, it must be the again. beard. That's some I bullshit, mate. Someone keep an eye on the red guy. This I'm shaving the beard. It, it must be the beard. I don't know what it is. That's some fucked up shit, right, mate. Sir, I'm going to put you back in cuffs. What, what, are, you, what are you doing uh, on here? I'm trying to talk to my homie. What? 
Why? What? You don't why see am... surrounded by cops? Are you yeah. Like master drug dealers? Why? <laughs> why am I going why back in cuffs? I'm Yo, trying essay. to make sure he's cool. Yo, essay. Who are you Tom. talking to? You. I'm a Vagos. Tom. All right, Vago, listen up. Who is this guy? Tell me who he is. His name's John. And what does he do? The motherfucking drug dealer. That's what he does. <laughs> All right. Well, that's enough for me. All right. Well, look, homeboy. I'm gonna cut you straight so, away. Get I just out of wanna dodge. update you, sir. Alright, man. Alright, peace, John. Two testimonies that say See that you actually do deal drugs. Uh, do you have anything to say on that matter? That's hearsay. That's, that's, that's hearsay. Book hearsay. That's hearsay. Yeah, that's, we're, gonna, uh, we're gonna bring him in. Alright, sir, how about you do get back to the vehicle? Do we have proof on what? this? I mean, you can't arrive, but what, I'm not, I haven't done anything. You have no proof that I'm a drug honestly, dealer. You got I mean, people. To... We don't have a warrant. We don't have nothing. I mean, unless someone saw it directly. So, yeah, if two, two people that. walk up to a single person on the side of the street and go, this guy's a drug dealer, that we guy immediately gets warrant. arrested for being a drug dealer? We yeah, but how many invest. how many calls have we been out with you related to drugs today? Look, one. This is the second one. Samson. Where are the drugs? What related drugs are you talking about? I'm not doing drugs. I don't have any drugs. What's Samson. up, bro? I swear to God. Oh my God. Jesus. <laughs> you got some weed? So go on, step right. back. And that's number three. All right. Uh, <laughs> listen, listen, we could light up a thousand <laughs> people. You got no evidence. You can't arrest me for something that I haven't done. What's up, right. man? Hey, man. Hang get, on. Get hang over on. there but across yeah, the street. Just put uh, uh, Someone yeah. just put him in my car. That's, yeah, this that's, is, that's some cold this shit. I'm trying to go surfing, bro. Go back to Rockford Hills. Samson. What? Yeah. I'm being if arrested? We can't articulate that a crime was committed inside the hotel room. What? if he admitted... He was in the hotel room. We can't arrest him. You this guys got a lawsuit Look, coming. I didn't arrest him. That's all that matters. You well, guys got I'm a fucking saying, lawsuit we, coming. Whoever is planning on the I didn't sir. put him in cuffs. We can't that's articulate that a crime was committed. We this is bullshit. At this time, we have a 24 hour hold on you just till we clear this all up. What that's the all... fuck? You are arresting innocent civilians that's all for hearsay. Consider this, if nothing Stop. else, sir, consider this us keeping you safe from the millions of members of Sandy Shores that want to come say hi to you, their drug dealer, all right? I'm not. This is. Oh, <laughs> oh man, this I'm going to get so much 24. money. I'm getting so much money. Money to like, buy drugs, right? Or sell them? This money from the government after this uh -huh. lawsuit goes all right. through. <laughs> all right. uh, book this up, is please. ridiculous. Oh, okay. That should have been good on your screen, though. <laughs> I got motherfucking <laughs> arrested. For uh, nothing. That's so what good. kind of law is that? <laughs> I just had to. I had to keep pressing it to see if I could get you. I'm going to get together like <laughs> oh, 10 dude. people and I'm going to find a cop and a random person on the street. And with 10 people, I'm going to walk up and go, this guy's a drug dealer. And that cop <laughs> better arrest that guy. What the fuck that's kind great. of shit is that? It is so ridiculous. Jesus Christ. I got arrested because of the thought that <laughs> I might be a drug dealer. people coming up and was like, hey, like hey, what's <laughs> up with the truck? What? <laughs> That is the most absurd uh, arrest, so I think, good. in the DOJ history. No, I think the worst would have been the fucking ticket of him fucking poundment over window tin. I mean, drug okay, dealing, I mean, yeah, that, that's fucking ridiculous, that, but... Yes, but this was literally matched right up next to it <laughs> of being arrested for just people saying that I'm a drug dealer. That's so what? fucking good. That was a good way to end it. Uh, it was. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, <laughs> that's gonna be great. Ridiculous.